guitar tips, guitar tips, just the tips, just for you, guitar tips. Hello, my name is Adam Levy. Welcome to yet another edition uh, of Guitar Tips. This is my weekly video blog post mm, thing that I do. Each and every Friday, I share a little bit of uh, guitar-related wisdom, wit, and what have you. And it's, it's free, and you can subscribe. There's a little uh, subscribe button down below. I hope you will. And uh, so without any further ado, here's this week's guitar tip. Keep your strap and your guitar connected. Keep your strap and your guitar connected. Um, I don't know about you, but I tend to have old favorite straps that I use for years and years. And because, uh, I don't know, I, they, they feel good, they look good, whatever. Um, but if you're taking the strap on and off of your guitar every time that you, that you play, after a while the, the hole in the strap that, that goes, the, the strap button goes through can start to get a little bit um, loose and doesn't hold on to your guitar the way that it should. And uh, I've never had the guitar fall off of, of me and all the way to the floor, but I've had a few close calls. So in order to uh, protect my guitar from falling to the floor, uh, I looked around. There's some commercial products that can do that. There's strap locks and other kinds of things. And some of them require modifying your guitar. Some do not. Um, I don't know. I just went for uh, an easy solution that uh, works. And so I'm going to share that with you. I use a, um, I don't know if you can see this, but it is, it is a rubber, black rubber washer. Looks like that. And you just put it over the strap button. I've never done it backwards like this, so it probably looks kind of awkward. Um, feels awkward, but anyway, uh, that's what it looks like. And that's going to keep your strap there. I have one there. I have one there. And uh, that's my solution. It's the these washers I got at my local hardware store. Um, it's made by a company called Danco um, in Boothwin, Pennsylvania. Actually, it says on the package, made in Taiwan, but it's sold through Danco Inc. Um, it's what it is. I'm, I'm just, I'll just show you the package. This is what it is. Um, I don't know if you can read that, but it's one and a half inches by five sixteenths by one sixteenth so that means the whole thing is one and a half across the hole is five sixteenths and it's one sixteenth thick um i'm sure you could find thicker ones i've seen some people use these red ones that i think come off of grolsch beer bottle caps um, those are a little thicker and depending on your guitar and the strap and whatever that can be a little bit tight maybe you want that um, I like these because I don't feel like it's putting any stress on the button, um, you know, to pull the screw out. <laughs> um, it's soft, it's flexible, it's black. Mostly, if, if people see it, if they don't notice it. I mean, they're more likely to see it on this end. But um, that's one reason I don't like the little Grolsch style washers is they're, they're, uh, they're kind of like red, like the color of... Uh, cinnamon red hots candies and um i like these because they're just a little stealthier i can't remember what i paid for this washer but it wasn't very much and you can buy a bag of them depending on how many guitars and straps you have um it's danco stock number 61810b um this is not a paid advertisement i don't know anyone at danco they're not sending me anything for free but I'm just sharing with you the specific thing that I use, and I'm sure you can find it at your local hardware store or online or what have you. So that's it. Keep your strap and your guitar connected, and then connect it all to yourself and to the music and to life. And that's it. That's the guitar tip this week. Uh, 
please subscribe uh, hit that red button down below and you'll be all tipped up week after week after week um, I'm Adam Levy for Guitar Tips stay tuned and take good care